Seven. And it sounds warm. Can I fall apart? Hey, Dan. Yeah. That's the 87. That sounds really warm. Yes. It's like every microphone is two microphones. Love is hardly spoken till the hourglass. I just don't want for you to lose this all of the use, baby. <laughs> so let me fall. Tell us about guitars, man. Heaven, huh? Yeah, well, I've, uh, I've, I've, I've liked it so much I went back and dumped everything out of Pro Tools and threw the tape machine and back in on a, on a couple of songs now. It's, man. What? Or let you deal with this. Your pillow holds a storyline that your lips have tried to tell, but couldn't give up. <laughs> that sounds so good. <laughs> what do you think of that, Dan McMains? You should be in here. It's. I gotta hear the 47 now. It's so. Th I know, this is the 87 too. It, it sounds so 3D. We we're setting up our first drum template with class by a two inch. So tell them what we got to do here, G, to make this different than normal. Normally we just run them, but now everything has to stay sequential. So we have to 14, 11, 12, 9. Ten. Eight. Eight. But he's not backseat driving, folks. Not at all. So then, yeah, so this is, this is going to knock the vibe, <laughs> the clean vibe that we have, everything in a certain order, but once we get done tracking this, so see how everything, one has to be one, two has to be two, three, four, five, six, seven has to go here. Wow, this is gonna be so weird, weird to look at. Tracking drums, baby. I gotta figure out how to get a separate headphone mix. Let's sack. Wow. Awesome, huh? expensive as sin, but it is cool, man. It is very cool. If you got the cake for it, man, this is such a cool way to work. It takes a few days to get the, the hang of it. You know, there's kind of a protocol to everything, and you know, once you get the feel for it, it's really quite easy. It's taken me about a week to really dig in and feel comfortable. So we just we just figured out how to punch drums. We had to raise the DSP, and uh, uh, here we go. So watch this. Same punch. Drums all muted for monitoring. 
I gotta figure out how to do a separate drum mix. We've got all the toms are off, all the overheads are off, all the room mics are off. So here's your first little clasp lesson. When you open up a session, you're gonna use clasp. The first thing you have to do before you import your clasp template is delete out any master faders you have on there. That's first. And then you gotta make sure that delay compensation is on, which it is on. And then we come over here and we import session drum template, which is a class template. All link to source media. Whoa, no tempo map. Let's see, right? And the next thing you got to do is you have to take the whole. Here, you film the thing. You got to take all the all the. the class tracks from top to bottom which is 16 audio and 16 masters and an aux you know slide them over to the left because it's off Huey protocol so everything your first track has to be uh, left and then the next thing you do is so critical disc allocation for whatever reason disc allocation does not move over in a class template ever so you've got to padow you don't want your drum tracks ending over on some bizarre template. And then you arm them. Put the zoom on this. Oh, that's why. Oh, yeah, yeah, I got you. Okay, okay. So we got to free up some voices. That's, that's the other thing. Um, 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 where am I at? Uh, playback engines. Yeah, the 64 ain't cutting in. So we got the 128, yes. So those are like some of the main things right at the beginning. We actually put together a little protocol sheet because Eric Greedy's coming in tomorrow. Yeah. Remove all master faders is one. Make sure delay compensation is on long. Two. Disc allocation. Three. baby so here's raw drums from our old room straight to Pro Tools let's know the difference God, and we got all those good drum sounds on those records we did, man. Now it's going to be... Do you hear the difference? And then this was... Today. Oh, my God. No comparison, right? Huge difference. Yeah. So, what do you guys think, man? Right. We did vocals today for the first time, and we did drums. Both were just phenomenal. Sounds a lot better. Yeah. It sounds huh? more rich and full. Yeah. Gosh. There you go. All right, we did it. Yep. Breaking down the drums. What an improvement, huh? Yeah, seriously. Wow. It actually sounds like a drum kit now. <laughs> I mean, to begin with. <laughs>